You already know what time it is. Is Tom Brady actually going to retire or not? What do you think? It is January 29th, 2022. What's in the shop today? Fortnite. There we go. The stashed skin, black and white, should be easy enough for combos. Pretty straightforward. Ooh, googly and prickly patroller. Sick. Prickly patroller is cool. I'm a desert boy. Gotta love the cactus stuff. So, the stashed skin for 800 V bucks. Selectable styles. Okay. I kind of like the white pants. Um. We've seen these pants before, these shoes before, etc. Um, another hooded character, regardless. If you like these use your supporter creator, that is P-I-Z-0. Pizza with a zero, you know we're getting it. Yes! Again, combos should be very, very easy. And then the harvesting tool is a bat with the cuddle team leader icons on it. What does it sound like? All right, pretty basic, but you know we're getting it. Yes! So I'm using Snow Squall for my glider. It's a very minimalistic black and white glider. And then my wrap is the Shadow Angular Shift. One thing I've always clowned with this particular character model um, with the pants is that it looks like you have poop in your pants. Um, I say it all the time about Moniker. I'm like, you got poop in your pants. It looks like a full diaper in his pants. Regardless, ADS should be fine here. Again, Shadow Angular Shift looks really good. A nice, a simple black and white wrap. No problems there. Um, again, Snow Squall for the glider. Combo should be a breeze. Shouldn't have any problems with that. I think I like the other edit style a little bit more with the all white pants, but um, something like this style, you would definitely want to do a black back bling because you have a full white, pretty much full white back on the actual jacket here. Nothing crazy on the streak. Like a black blurred out version, black and white blurred out version. Mm. It's pretty average. Nothing too exciting about it. But I do like bats. I do. I do like them. Impact is pretty average here. Again, the streak is more of a blurred out version of it. Now, the additional edit style. I believe I like a little bit more. Um, I do want to see what the back of the character looks like. This one gives me more of an Adidas um, fit with the stripes on the pants and the stripes on the arms here. I think I like this version more because it's not a full color, all white or all black on the jacket, which makes um, back flings that you're using not so easily to be disappeared. Like if it's all white on a white shirt already, it's gonna be a little strange. But I do like this edit style more if I had to choose, just because I do like the um, the actual design on the jacket. We can go to night as well here. Overall, it's a clean skin. It's an uncommon with an additional edit style, which is no problem there. The harvesting tool is, it looks cool, but it's pretty boring and average. But again, it's an uncommon. But with that being said, it is daytime and it is combo time. So I am deciding to do the second edit style for combos because I do like the black and white um, accents on the actual uh, sweater that he's wearing. So we have Spooky Smalls here that pulls katanas, the Spider-Man icon, the black owl bag looks pretty clean, um, Stark Satchel as well because it is black and white. It doesn't get completely lost compared to an all white sweater. So keep that in mind. Um, we have the night bag here. Ignition hunting fresh out your kitchen, baby. We have the everyday sleek pack. The cuddly bones bow. The bone wings. Wings here. <laughs> it's just so stupid. I'm so dumb. We have blast radius. We can do both edit styles here. I like the white ones personally. Um, with that style. We have the ball bling with the scratch. Ultra ego. We'll call it scratch ball. Whatever cue ball. We can also do the eight ball as well. We have the lane splitter, which looks clean. The logo lugger. The Grinning Ghoul, the Las Vegas Raiders looks really clean. And also the actual harvesting tool, I noticed it, but I didn't really say anything about it. The harvesting tool does have like a gray scale. So pairing that tool with the Raiders logo will look 10 out of 10. We have the Skate Pocket Duffel 
and the Zombo. I think because of the black and white color scheme, you do have a lot of flexibility to add an additional color to give it more of a colorful combo. Like if you want to do like a red bag bling, add like a red wrap that has some black and white. I think it'll look really cool, but I want to show you the logo of GoGo with the Raiders with the actual bat. Never mind, I lied because I can't see the bat when I point it out. But you can see here, it does have the same colors as the Raiders do on the back thing there. So overall, very easy to review. You get two edit styles for an uncommon skin and it's clean. I've never liked the pants or the shoes that they use for models like this. It looks like poop in their pants, but regardless, I think it's a decent bang for your buck. This screams Adidas to me. I'm also wearing an Adidas hat right now, but regardless, it's clean um, and combos. You have a lot of flexibility. I'll say that a lot of flexibility with your combos. And with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. And a supporter creator, P-I-Z-0 in the Adam Shop. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you guys on the live stream. See ya!